So creating shortcuts on your iPhone or iPad is a really cool way to customize look your home screen with custom app icons or even custom automations to make life easier on iOS. Now I'm going to be showing you how to make this happen on my iPhone running iOS 16. And of course, if you guys want to get on our iOS newsletter, check out all things iOS related. We'll have some resource links in the description. I'm just going to go over a couple examples here of what you can do. And the first thing I want to do is create an automation. Now. You can do so many different automations on here, but the one I want to check out first for you guys is going to be a battery charging automation. And this is just going to give you an idea of all the cool things you can do with shortcuts, right? Okay, anyways, um, now what I'm going to do here is choose an action for this automation. So it's going to be opening up an app, right? So I'm searching for that and now I got to select an app, which is going to be my uh, charging animation app. So we're going to find it. Okay, now I'm gonna click done and I'm gonna show you what this looks like, just this one app giving it this automation, but it's really cool. So when I plug my iPhone in, it's gonna pull up this animation that I have set using this third party app. So check it out. Oh yeah, it's even got some music playing. That's pretty sweet, right? All right, so we got an Apple logo animation and without using shortcuts, none of this would even be possible. So this is just one example of what you can do. And now the next thing I'm gonna do is create an app icon. And this is one of the things a lot of people do on shortcuts, but like I said, you can do other things like these automations and there's a lot of different ones. But uh, we'll do one here for the app store. So let's say you wanna create a custom app icon, you can do, do that or just change an app icon. So we're just gonna click select here. We're gonna name what we're gonna do here, which is gonna be app store. Now, kind of back to the same thing here, you need to give an action for this, right? So we're gonna use the action open app. Okay, and then we're gonna choose the app, which is gonna be the app store. Okay, and now we gotta name it and give it a picture, right? So check this out. All right, click and add to home screen. And we got the purple app store icon looking real slick, right? Okay, now I'm gonna click done and then you can see it'll put it on the home screen. Now, when you click on it, it's gonna open it, but it's gonna give a little icon at the top that says use the shortcut in order to use that. And uh, this is just another example of what you can do on shortcuts. So, I mean, iOS 15, uh, it is a little bit different on here. I'm not gonna lie from using shortcuts on iOS 14 to 15, there's just, a couple minor differences in how it looks and how you add things. But for the most part, I definitely recommend everybody use this app. It's free. You can have a lot of fun with it and you can create automations, app icons, and a bunch of other cool things. Okay. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please smash the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Thanks for watching and we will see you in the next one.